Welcome to this Techquipment VDAS support video. Today we'll be looking at how to set up a connection to your VDAS hardware. The latest version of Techquipment VDAS is freely available to download from our website www.techquipment.com and is compatible with all VDAS enabled Techquipment products. Each VDAS enabled product comes with a manual explaining how to connect to a suitable PC running VDAS software. Most products connect via our VDAS Hub, which is available in both a bench-mounted and frame-mounted form factor. The VDAS Mark II Hub allows for connection of up to six VDAS devices. The VDAS Mark II Hub connects to a PC over USB. Only one VDAS Hub can be connected to a PC at a time. A few of the Techquipment products come with VDAS inside. These products are connected directly to the PC with a USB lead without the use of a VDAS Hub. When you first open VDAS, you'll be prompted to select the product you wish to work with. For this demonstration, I'm going to use the generic data acquisition screen. VDAS will remember the last screen used and reopen to this screen the next time you open VDAS. You can change VDAS screen by going to the options select VDAS application menu. Now that you've opened VDAS, you can connect to a VDAS hub by clicking on the button in the toolbar. If you've connected to the correct experiment and the hardware is switched on, the input fields should display values. As a useful diagnostic tool, when there is data being sent to a field, the gear icon on the group box will start turning. And that's it for this Techquipment VDAS support video. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask them here on YouTube or via Facebook or Twitter. Thank you for watching.